So guys, we are starting with the Shein Single Breasted Contrast Trim Fuzzy Cardigan. This one is a size medium, so it is cropped. It has this nice lilac purpley color with the white outline. The buttons are white. They come. So guys, we are starting with the Shein Single Breasted Contrast Trim Fuzzy Cardigan. This one is a size medium, so it is cropped. It has this nice lilac purpley color with the white outline the buttons are white they come kind of high up it is very cropped i just paired it with these black leggings for simplicity and ease and the quality of it is amazing the thickness is great it actually feels like it's got good substance um it's really soft it's actually not itchy material which is kind of what i was expecting i'm obsessed with furry things right now it does make me look a little bit busty so it's not my favorite i really did have high hopes for this one but it's a little bit too baboom um, but other than that, it's cute. I actually think it would look better paired with loose jeans, but you know what? I ain't complaining. Yeah, looks pretty good. I do notice that this starts to pull apart and this is a size medium guys. So I usually am a size small to extra small zero to two. I have gained a little bit of weight due to COVID and some medications I'm currently taking, but regardless of the fact I should not still be a size medium. So take into account when you order from Shein that their size mediums still run tiny, but Overall, if I button this, let's see how it looks buttoned. So it doesn't look as good buttoned up at top just because my breasts are bigger, so it does create that pull. But overall, like I said, I am a huge fan of this sweater in combination with some of the other ones that I got. I will, look how fuzzy I got the fuzzies. Um, so we will get started on the next fuzzy sweater. Okay, so the next one is the fluffy knit button down front sweater. It was $25 and it comes in one size. So I actually wore this one to work the other day with um, a skirt, a short skirt and some long brown booties. It was very fall-esque to say so, so myself. So this cut isn't particularly my favorite out of all the sweaters. Now the quality was actually, again, so good. It's stretchy, it's really soft and comfortable. It's not like overly hot or weird. Um, I am like a ginormous official fan of their fuzzy sweater materials because they're like some of the best fuzzy sweaters I've ever had. And again, I just paired it with simple leggings this time. I would, I prefer it with the skirt and the boots, but you know, it works well. Um, and this one is a one size. So being the one size, it fits pretty well. It's not too big, it's not too loose. The arms are a great length. Everything about it is like kind of perfect. It's just the cut that's not my favorite, but overall, and the buttons, their buttons tend to look a little bit cheaper, but. So yeah, it's probably not the best outfit combo that I put with it, but like I said, again, and it was 20 something dollars. I probably wouldn't buy this particular one again, but I will probably keep this one, especially since I already wore it, but. Um, so, sorry, on to the next one. So the next one is the button front ribbed knit fuzzy cardigans, $20, one size. And guys, this one was actually one of my favorites. The material, again, it's so stretchy, so soft, so comfortable, but it's not like that fuzzy soft material that you would be thinking. It's just like a, a perfect material. It's absurd. You would not expect it. I mean, you are paying a little bit more with um, Shein than you would be with Zoffel or something like that. So it really is hit or miss on what you get. But so far from all the sweaters that I've purchased from Shein, they have been amazing like hands down amazing this one was one of my favorites the only problem i always do it opposite is the dangling strings so the loose thread other than that there was no other loose threads again crop length is perfect stretch is perfect i do like the black on white contrast um it is so comfortable like almost joa brown status comfortable and that, that's saying a lot because joa brown stuff is quite expensive so would i buy this again absolutely i am going to return this one for a different one because my heart is in love. And again, this would probably also look better with jeans, but I'm doing this for ease and convenience. Um, and so you guys can get a good take just because black pants, everything really goes with black pants. So we will move on to the next. I am back with number four, which is the Shein Cloud Fuzzy Sweater. It was $29. I got a size small, which is technically a four. So I love the design. I, I do. I really wish this one could work. It is a little extra frumpy. It is very comfortable. It's just not as flattering of an oversized sweater as I would like. Again, that material is really great. This one, I do have to say, wow, it kind of looked like a cloud right now, like this extra poop in here. Um, I do have to say that when I purchased this and I opened the bag, I instantly got this odory, toxic smell. Yeah, yeah, it kind of smells like pee in a way. I don't know why my boyfriend is convinced that they're using dog fur. Um, 
because it, their stuff is so soft and it is much better quality than you would expect. But again, I'll take a step back. Give you guys credit. But overall, like I love the design, love the idea of this sweater. I just think that the execution wasn't perfect, so it's probably not a keeper for me. I will continue along my path of searching for a fuzzy clown sweater. So sad. And really, the smell bothers me more than anything, and I'm sure after a wash that would go away, but it's just between the sizing and the awkwardness of how it fits and how it looks and the smell, um, it's not a keeper for me. So we will move on to number five. Hey guys, so for number five, it is the button front fuzzy knit cardigan. It was $19 and I got a size medium. And this is Piggy Smalls, my little micro chihuahua. She's being a little chihuahua whiner right now. So she wants to be held. So we'll do this with Piggy. So I love this sweater. The buttons are the cheapest part of it. It is fuzzy. It is a great color. It's a great length. I did decide to do it with jeans this time. So you guys can have a diversified feel of how some of their sweaters look. Again, I do think that the fuzzy sweaters do tend to make me look a little bit bustier for whatever reason, or maybe it's just the way that Shein's shirts fit. Um, but overall, I love their fuzzy stuff. I can't get enough. The material is great. The stretch factor is great. I have not sent any of these through the wash, so I'm not sure on how they will look after they get washed the first time. I might try it out with one of them before buying any more because at this point I am obsessed with fuzzy sweaters. So fuzzy clothes in general. Um, and you make a good accessory my friend so as you guys can see it's quite flattering it's fuzzy it's cute it's stretchy all of the above are good it was only $19 which is great the material kind of compares to Joa Brown's material which is really great just because it's not rayon by any means but it is the same it does still feel like heaven on your body and you don't have to pay $80 per shirt for it so we will move on to number six I am excited to show you guys because it's one of my faves so we are on number six, and this is actually one of my favorite sweaters. As you guys can see, it's kind of this multicolored blue, gray, white, pinkish. It's got these big bell-bottom sleeves. It is cropped and kind of tucked in, so it already looks like it's tucked into your shirt for you. I personally, I love this. I don't know why. I, I was not expecting this to be one of my favorites, but it turned out to be. So I love when that happens. And it is sweater season, people. So as you can see, super cute super uber cute i like wish they have it in three different colors um now this one is a it is not a one size so i got a size small in this sweater and because it is a looser fit so they do have two other colors available but they both looked so much like this color that it was not worth buying now if they made it in other colors i would absolutely already have the other colors on their way to my home because this sweater just goes with so many different things. I've worn it with yoga leggings. I've worn it on top of jeans. I've worn it with nice dress pants. I've worn it to the gallery um, or to work. So you really get a big diversified area in where you can wear this sweater. So on to... So guys, I am so excited for you guys to see number seven. I did have high hopes about this and it is called the Solid Crop Fuzzy Knit Slim Sweater. It was $17 and I got a size small. Now the model in the picture also has larger breasts. Um, so I decided I would give it a try because I love the color. It is a green color now I hope you guys are ready for this because it is so absurd now when I bought these sweaters this was more along the lines of what I was thinking material wise it's really great again texture it's really great they're using a lot of the same materials for their fuzzy sweaters so I mean hands down if I see a sweater that I think I'm gonna like I'm gonna buy it from there and try it on anyway but this is the sweater that they sent to me this this little number right here now again in the picture guys the female that is wearing it has breasts that are much bigger than mine, so I don't know why this is happening or why it's like this. This is, yeah, right? So sexy, so sexy. <laughs> it's so absurd, but clearly this is a no. The crop is way too short. I don't know whose chest could fit in this unless you're like literally flat chested, then maybe, maybe you'll have a tiny bit of under boob showing, but this is clearly not a sweater for bigger breasted women. Uh, and if I were to do it again, I would probably get a size medium, but I'm not going to do it again because as you can see, it's, it's not its finest. So we'll move on to number eight because like I said, I bought like so many of these sweaters and make sure you guys to click the like button, the follow button, the subscribe button, the notifications button, click all of the buttons, just all of them while we're at it. Um, and we will go ahead and move on. Okay, guys, I am back with number eight, and that is the O-Ring Zip Back Fuzzy Chain Cami Crop Top. It was $12, and I got a size extra small because it does not, it does zip in the back. That's why I got the extra small. 
So this, I had higher hopes for. It literally looks like, I don't know, I'm wearing an animal on, on my body or something. Um, the straps are made from these chains. You know, I, I like the idea, but the chain straps are like way, way too big. And even if I pulled this down, it just, it kind of just, yeah, I mean, I don't know. Comment below and tell me what you think about this shirt, because for me, I think it looks absurd. But I don't know, maybe some of you other people like it, so. I like that the back is not as fuzzy. Um, like I said, the chains are really long and cold. The under boobs tend to pop out of the sky. And it doesn't have much support or guidance. Now, if the chains were, even if the chains were lifted, it's still kind of, I mean, I would wear that maybe, but like all the way down here, no. It, it does. It looks like I just have like a weird throw blanket over my my chest so this one for me is not a keeper but like i said still comment below let me know what you think i feel like i'm from um austin powers or something but that's kind of like the vibe that i like so i don't see what's wrong with it on to number eight or maybe number nine number nine so guys, I am back with the number nine, and that is the V-neck surplus front tie back fuzzy sweater. It was $23, and it comes in one size only. So this is the only color, too. It is one of my favorites between the material, the comfort, the style, everything, all of the above. This did turn out to be one of my favorites. I love the puffy sleeves. I wish they had this in more colors, but they unfortunately don't. They've got other sweaters that are like it. So as you can see, it ties in the back, or maybe the front, because it said it tied in the front. So let's, let's try that. I guess it doesn't look too bad, but you know, I'm just gonna keep it tight on the back, so. So yes, I love it. The bell bottomy sleeves, it's a perfect length. It's so soft, no itchiness. And that for me is huge because I hate itchy sweaters with a burning passion. So I have worn this with jeans, I've worn it with skinny jeans, open leg jeans, um, yoga leggings, yoga shorts, so I've really worn it with a plethora of things and it really does look good with pretty much all of them. So again, this is 100% a buy and a keep for me. I will not be returning this, my friend. So yeah, overall, love it. So the next one is something similar in here. You get a better idea of the color in this lighting for some reason. Um, so yes, moving on to number nine. So I'm back with number 10 and it is similar to that blue sweater we just tried on. This one is called the Fuzzy Tie Back Wrap Sweater. It was $25 and it comes in one size. So as you guys can see, it's similar to the blue one that I just tried on. The only thing is that the sleeves aren't as bell bottom as the last sweater. I do still like this sweater because like the material is the same, the fit is pretty much the same, everything's the same. So there's no reason for me not to like this sweater, but I do definitely like the other sweater more between color and shape and size. It's definitely better um, in the other sweater. So take that into account. If you guys are shopping for sweaters in Shein, that even though they look the same, they can be quite different. And I don't know why I'm having this crazy hair day, um, but that's okay with me. It is called the Solid Fuzzy Sweater Without Camisole. So unlike the green one that you saw earlier, this one is supposed to be this size. Now I'm just not sure how to wear it. So in the picture, she's wearing it and I'll include it somewhere here or here because I always get these sides mixed up for some reason. It's weird that it's opposite. But in the picture, she's wearing a like white camisole underneath. Now again, just so you guys can get the detail, it is still fuzzy. I just don't know how I feel about it. Overall, it is kind of funny. I thought it could look cute. And like in some instances, I think it does, but like I just personally can't figure out how to wear it. Now again, that was a size small, so it does come in other sizes and it was $17. So this to me is not worth $17 probably because like I said, I just don't know how to wear it.
Well, that concludes our she in. I don't know if I said Zoffel earlier, but I, that concludes our she in fuzzy sweater haul. Thank you guys so much for watching Mary J's hauls. Make sure to click the like button, the subscribe button, and the notifications button. I am doing these hauls all the time on so many different things, but it's not just for me. It is for you guys too. Don't spend the money if you don't have to. I personally love trying on clothes. So this was no biggie for me. It's something I do in my everyday kind of. Um, most of the stuff that I, we went over, I probably will be sending back. I do have a very large haul coming out on their athletic wear just to see if it can hold up or compare to any of the other big brands such as Aloe, Wolven, uh, Beyond Yoga, all of those other guys. So make sure to subscribe to my channel guys so you guys can follow me. Um, and I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day and keep fuzzy sweaters in mind. Thanks for watching Mary J. Sauls, guys. Peace.